everyone, today I am back with another Invest Today video. On this day, Disney announced many new live action Disney films, but only a couple are going to theaters, with the majority going to Disney Plus. Today I am going to discuss the four movies that are still going to be released in theaters as of right now. First to be released is Cruella, set to release on the 26th of May 2021. It is a prequel for the 101 Dalmatians film, and it is an origin story for Cruella de Vil. It will star Emma Stone as Estella, aka Cruella, and Emma Thompson as the Baroness. Set in 1970s punk rock London, the basic plot is that the Baroness, the head of a prestigious fashion house, plucks Estella from obscurity as a burgeoning designer. They showed a sizzle reel to investors, but the general public couldn't see it. It was rumoured that this film would go to Disney Plus from quite a few reliable sources, but I think they were forced to take it to theatres because of contracts with the leading actors. I think this film is going to be quite similar to Maleficent, which I really enjoyed, so I'm looking forward to it. Second to be released is Jungle Cruise on the 30th of July 2021. It is based on the Disney ride of the same name and will star Dwayne The Rock Johnson as a Jungle Cruise skipper and Emily Blunt as a researcher. Together they go on a mission into the jungle to find the Tree of Life, which is believed to possess healing powers. We have already seen a lot of footage from this film as it was supposed to be released this year and I actually think it's going to be really good. The leads have a lot of good chemistry and it looks like it's going to be a perfect blend of action, adventure and comedy. The third movie to be released in theatres is the live action remake of The Little Mermaid. They released the first logo for the film and I loved it. It was absolutely beautiful. Rob Marshall, the director of Mary Poppins Returns is directing and it will include all of the classic songs from the 1989 animated film along with new songs by Alan Menken and Lin-Manuel Miranda. They officially announced the leading cast but we already knew all of them already. It includes Halle Bailey as Ariel, David Diggs as Sebastian, Javier Bardem as King Trident, Jacob Tremblay as Flounder, Melissa McCarthy as Ursula, Jonah Howard King as Prince Eric, and Aquafina as Scuttle. We don't have a release date yet, but considering that it is only starting to film in January, I think the earliest we can expect it is late 2022, but probably 2023. This is the theatrical release that I'm most excited for. I love The Little Mermaid. It's one of my favourite movies, and I also love the remakes. I know it's an unpopular opinion, but I'll watch them. They're amazing. The final theatrical film is a prequel to the 2019 live-action Lion King. And yes, I know it's not live action, but it's easier to call it that. It will be directed by Barry Jenkins, who also directed the Oscar-winning film Moonlight. It will basically be a Mufasa origin story, which will include his relationship with Scar. We don't have an exact release date yet, but I think it's going to be a while. As I said in my previous video, I think that this is a really bad idea. Nobody really liked the first live action Lion King, and I don't think people are going to want to see this. Anyway, let me know what Disney theatrical release you are most excited for in the comments down below. Like this video if you liked it and please subscribe. It would mean so much to me. Bye now and have a magical day.